What's up guys, Doyler here with my first Idle Heroes video. Uh, first of all, I apologize for the Bluestacks status bar and the weird resolution. This was my first time recording the phone, so hopefully next time it's a little bit cleaner. Today's video is just going to be a, a quick demo of me going through the dailies on my alt account. As you can see, I'm rocking a almost full 6 star, uh, formerly Rainbow team, but replaced the Michelle with the Siggy. Don't really have a lot of materials yet, but hopefully I'll be able to catch up and finish these bond quests at least on my main account. So, as you can see, uh, just going through a few of the dailies, um, currently solo in this guild. I may need to bring my main account over to try and knock out these battles faster. I don't know if they fixed the guild coins, guild coin collection from previous bosses. If not, my main may not actually have any of these bosses complete, so hopefully that'll be fun to check. I do have two new members in these in this guild. They just managed to apply while the account was inactive. We'll see if they help any. Uh, only level 5 in the fortress. Uh, once I get to 6, I'll be able to start the exploration. That should happen either today or tomorrow. We'll see. wasn't even able to smash that in one hit this time. Uh, I think my first E5 on this account is going to be Horus. That said, I have no copies of him, so it's going to take a while. So sweet. Like I said, we hit level 6. Um, so now I'm going to start the first exploration. It'll take a while. And as you can see, I don't really have much in the way of heroes or monsters on this secondary account. Um, honestly, I created it a few years ago. And I'm building it up now, mostly for the Bond Quest, but I may use it for other introductory videos, things of that nature. So I'll set my lineup. Uh, I like setting my best team to the weapon system. Let me know what you guys do, if you find any teams are weaker or stronger. I don't really know the point of setting them to a specific, since you can't actually see your opponent's lineups, but we'll see. Um, I am glad that I didn't take any heroes past six stars on this account, since honestly, when I made this account, uh, Rainbow was still probably <laughs> meta, um, and GVE was basically unobtainable. I have started purchasing the profit orbs on this a little more often. Um, that last profit event to get the Delosiums really ran me out on my main account, so we'll see. I don't plan on having any background music, but I also feel like I have to talk through most of this video with no sound effects. Let me know what you guys think in the comments as far as you know, long uh, gaps of silence, especially for daily videos like this. Obviously when I do Flame Shrine and Broken Spaces, there'll be a bit more things to talk about, but for the, the shorter dailier videos, if I should have background music, periods of silence, or talk the whole time. So only one chip I found, so it's still going to take a few more days. Thankfully I have some strong friends that quit the game, so I'm able to finish level 5 and level 6, so that'll help with the gearing. I think I'm going to push for 6 star gear as fast as possible. Uh, I need to look at the math again, but I believe that 6 star gear is a huge upgrade, especially compared to stuff like... Um, E1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, um, and I know that the next weekly dailies do include a workshop, so hopefully I can, I think my highest is 3 star right now, if I can push to a 4 star I'll definitely push to a 6 star set, um, I don't know if I'll actually push for class specific armor yet since I really don't know who I'm going to use other than Hormus yet, um, as I said, um, 4 star and 5 star is my highest. And I'm upgrading Starlight now since, um, if you saw in the previous section, she was doing a lot more damage than Kareem. I don't know if she always had been. I wasn't paying attention or what. The 9-star Bone Carver, or the 9-star Puppet, may actually be stronger than my Bleaker at this point. We'll have to see. It would be funny to level up one of those and use him in some of my lineups. But, obviously, I'm waiting to eventually use him to... Um, as fodder for ideally horse, but 
Unfortunately, I started this account up again after both the summon and the orb event, so I'll have to wait a while. Um, I did get a pair of antlers, though, so that was a, a nice grab from the anniversary event. Um, hopefully I'll be able to use those and probably not upgrade them ever. Um, as you can see, I'm just upgrading my equipment, make sure everyone's set and up to date. That'll be uh, about it for this video. Make sure to obviously like and subscribe. This is a pretty boring first video, but the first real video I hope to release tomorrow sometime later this week is going to be the Flame Shrine series on my main account, including my new Delasium army. So thanks, stay tuned.